Today we have the 2017 Ford Mustang GT California Special Convertible. We're going to drive it with the top up and also with the top down. But first, let's see what sets the California Special apart from a regular GT. So we'll walk up here and take a quick look at the wheels. They are 19 inch wheels that you can only get for a California Special. They're 25540 diameter. And at the rear of the vehicle we have the GT badging obviously and then the California Special in the middle there as well. We have a black wing and then black accents across the side of the uh, doors and then on top of the hood here as well. Now for 2017, the turn signal that was added for 2016 is now removed. Would have been nice to still have that. This is a beautiful, gorgeous Mustang. Let's jump inside. GT CS, Cal GT California Special Badging in the seats. We've got beautiful red contrast stitching, um, leather slash Alcantara interior for the front and the back. Push button start, six speed manual, put the clutch down. Now this is a premium, so you have the 8-inch SYNC 3 infotainment system now available with Apple CarPlay. Different driving modes, steering modes, traction control, and your hazards with these beautiful toggles here. You get heated and cooled seats. Beautiful day in Pittsburgh today, 72 degrees and sunny on November 18th. So we have the cooled seats on and the top down. Now, as I'm sure you guys can tell, the uh, windows are down and it is a bit windy. Um, it's not bad inside the cabin, but I do know that the mic for the GoPro here is horrible when it comes to wind noise. It doesn't muffle anything. So we're gonna pull the windows up here so we can hear the difference. So we got one button here for the two rear windows. See those are up and then we pull the two side windows up here. So it is a considerably less wind noise inside the cabin here as it should be when you pull the windows up. But this is a perfect day for a car like this. It is 73 degrees outside, I got the cooled seats on and you feel or yeah you maybe you would feel the wind blowing in your hair, I'm bald so I feel the uh, wind blowing on top of my head and it's awesome this is a brand new 2017 GT stock exhaust still sounds good though so what we're gonna do now is go ahead and put the top up and then you use the buttons located right here
very simple process and then you just pull the handle pull that and then put the windows up Turn the temperature down a little bit. By the way, we have the phenomenal Shaker Pro 550 watt stereo system. Don't you cry no Never does justice on a video like this, but it is an excellent system. It's by far the best one that you can get in any Ford. All right, so here we go. For 2017, it is still the same 5 liter V8, 435 horsepower, and 400 pound feet of torque. It's an excellent engine. And we're going to go ahead and put this vehicle in sport mode. Just use the toggle switch here, and you'll see it on the middle instrument cluster normal, sport plus, track and then snow and wet mode. We go ahead and put it in track. That turns off all the traction control settings and everything here. That is a considerable difference in the throttle response and the way that the transmission will behave. Such a difference. This Mustang GT, it pulls really, really good. I, I am impressed with this engine, although it doesn't obviously live up to the uh, 2016 GT350 that I drove earlier this year. Not as rev happy and does definitely, definitely not sound as good. But we're going to pull over here and then we're going to put the top back down because there is no more perfect day than today to drive with the top down all right so let's do this process again uh, to get the top down all you do is release this hatch manually and then you have the button right here when I push it the top will go down the windows will automatically go down We're going to pull the windows back up. And then we'll do another pull with the windows up here, but the top obviously still down. such a difference in the suspension as well when you have it in track mode let's put it in sport plus mode 
and you notice right away that the suspension gets softer it's not as bumpy and we put it back in normal Mustang GT is a very easy car to drive in a manual. The clutch is not too stiff. It has a good grabbing point. The throws and the transmission. They're not as short as in a uh, GT500, but just perfect. Uh, this car is meant to be a cruiser obviously it's not a gt with a performance package or a gt350 now as i'm filming this video i don't really know exactly how much wind noise you guys are hearing so i'm going to go ahead and put the top back up so i know that i have parts of this video at least where you guys actually hear what i'm saying and actually hear the uh, sound of the engine so we'll pull in right here and put the top back up secure it put the windows up the temperature down even more it's can't believe it's this warm on November 18th in Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. Oh, a little jump there. <laughs> Alright, so let me know what you guys think of the 2017 Ford Mustang GT California Special Convertible. And if this is your first time visiting the channel and you haven't already, please subscribe and I'll see you in the next video. Bye bye.